Alrighty, folks. I got a few items from eBay I wanted to share with you. Let's start opening the first box. Pretty big box for trying to remember what I got. A lot of bubble wrap. All right, let's get this out of here and move this box real quick. More bubble wrap. All right, let's see what's in this box. New Athens. All right. Oh, cool. Another uh, Canadian Pacific rail. That'll go with my other one over in the corner. I'll do a little uh, video afterwards with it. Alright, let's move this out of the way. On to the second box. Alrighty. Of course, I removed the addresses and everything. Because I don't want no one, you know, some people don't like their uh, address shown. So, disrespect that way. Alright, let's see how we open this box. Hopefully this is the right spot. We'll find out here. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Alright. Cool, these are my 3D parts that I ordered. So, they're uh, dumpsters right here with the lids right here that I got to clean up with the flashing still. And I've been waiting for over, I don't know, a couple weeks now. So the, uh, the first package got lost in the mail. So the guy ended up throwing two sets of dumpsters this time. And I have, these are, look at these, cook machines to add to my layout after I clean them up and paint them. Cool little wheel, wheelbarrows. Those are pretty cool. Uh, cool. Another wheelbarrow. A little dude. And, oh, we got a couple, we got, looks like, uh, three guys in here. And what's this? Ooh, cool. Ice machines. I don't have any of those. Those are nice of him. Let's see if any address or anything on the letter he sent. Alright. Thank you, Josh, for hanging in there. And hope the extra added items will satisfy if all is good. Yeah, that's pretty nice of him. I tell you what, that's a great guy right there. I'm happy. I will contact him in a bit here. That's really nice of him. He went out of his way, and I say he went, you know, did it the extra, just you know, satisfied a customer. All right. Last item. Of course, if I remember right, it's a. Uh, the locomotive I ordered, but I really don't like how they put it in a bubble wrap, you know, protected envelope like this. But at least it's got bubble wrap inside, too. So hopefully, it's all in good condition. All right, try to be careful. 
careful. Don't want to hurt the engine. And it seems like it was wrapped pretty good, luckily. Ooh, that's nice. Look at that. That's pretty clean. And I'm sure this is a tender right here. Cool, nice southern. Sweet. do some testing here bear with me all right let's give her some power and see what happens of course nothing it might need a little bit of cleaning no biggie I'm getting power for the other train so that's pretty cool. Nothing that we can't check out later on. So, we'll see what happens later. Alright. Now the two cars are together. Now all I need to do is find a locomotive. Check her out. Everything's coming along. Got my UFO in the corner. With the little alien and everything. And, of course, I got the fire station and everything going in. And I have my uh, engine building, my engine house that I've been working on. I'm trying to put a lot of detail in it, actually. I'm going to raise this up and show you. Check it out. I'm putting a pit in there. So I'm going to make a, a guy, I got a pit on each side. So I'm going to have a guy in the bottom with a, a blue uh, uh, flickering LED. Look like he's welding underneath of a locomotive or something. So I thought that'd be pretty cool. Give me a, a, let me know what you think about that one. So I think that would be sweet. So it's coming along good. Thanks for watching. What's up, Rail fans? Greybeard here again. I ended up getting some items in the mail finally off eBay that I purchased. And I wanted to open up this package I got. I have two, uh, one package and one envelope that I ended up with. Wanted to share with everyone what I ended up picking up. I didn't have one of these HO uh, locomotives, and I thought I'd like to share this with you. I haven't seen one. So this is pretty cool. Let's run up real quick. Glad he uh, wrapped it up really good. Did a great job wrapping it. Check this sucker out. And it's a, it's a Lionel Chicago and Eastern Illinois HO locomotive. I haven't seen one. And this thing's pretty sweet. And of course, pretty clean too. So. I can't wait to see if it rhymes or not. Do a test on this one. But yeah. That's pretty cool. It's one of those last minute things. I saw it on uh, eBay. It was ending in a few hours. And I got so lucky to end up winning this one. I'm glad I was able to get it. Put it with my collection. 
All right, now I have an envelope. All right, these are decals I ended up trying to get. What? Okay. They're a little small ones. I know they're hard to see, but uh, they're uh, Ringling Brothers and Bombardier Circus decals. So I thought you all like to see all that, and uh, I will do an update once I uh, see if this. I'll show you guys to see about getting a test run on a locomotive. So I hope you all enjoy this video. I will have an update on this. Please stay tuned. All right, everyone. I ended up purchasing some uh, picnic table 3D uh, printed kit. I wanted to uh, share with you. Of course, everything still has the flashing and everything on it, as you can see. So I got the tops of the picnic tables right here. And the benches and the sides and everything. So, at least the uh, gentlemen put the tape on the back. This way they don't fall apart or get lost. So that'd be pretty cool. I can't wait to put this together. And on the other day, when I here's what these dumpsters came out to look like from the the last 3D printed the same guy. They turned out really good. And I got a whole bunch of dumpsters now. And of course, I have wheelbarrows that I did, as you can see. And I have one of the guys so far painted right there. Not too shabby, I think. But also, I wanted to do a... Uh... Oh, yeah. Well, I'm thinking about it. I did the ice chest, too. That I got from the kit. And it turned out like that. So I got two of those painted like that. And I also did the Coke machines. I tell you what, the lettering is not really easy to paint. So, a lot of graphics on it, though. So, they turned out really good, I think. So, also, this uh, Lionel locomotive, I wanted to see about doing a test run and seeing how it runs. So, let me pull this out of the plastic right here again you know didn't want nothing happening to it at least it was well packaged like I said before so it's pretty sweet I just want to see if it runs or if we're gonna need a little bit of cleaning on it what's going on with it we'll do a test run on the track. I think it's on the track. It acts like it's on the track. All right, let's try it again. I got that 3D printed stuff on the track. Let's move it. So it does run.
but not as good. So I say this engine right here is going to need a little bit of cleaning, but for what I paid, it's not bad. It'd be worth it. I know we can get it running. So, hope you all enjoy this one. And I'm going to pan around and show you some of the work I've been doing to my layout. Alrighty. I've been working on my tunnel some more. Been making uh, rocks in the mold and everything. So that's what it's looking like so far. Of course, I'm going to fill in the cracks in between yet. But it takes time to make all the uh, plaster, mix it up, and let it set in the molds. Because you got to let everything dry. I wish I had more than one mold. It would really go good and easier. But look at that. Really coming along really nice. So I stuck, I got one Coke machine there. And my other trash cans are over there. I even got some where they're open too. So it's coming along good. I'm having fun. Something I do to relax. And here's the other side of the tunnel. I still got to try to do some detail on the inside yet. I've been uh, picking up some stuff and here and there. I have more uh, items. That I got another uh, uh, item coming from eBay. I'll be uh, doing an unboxing of that one too. Can't wait to show you all. So, I hope you all enjoy this one. Gotta love that military train. It's freaking sweet. Well, I hope you all enjoy this video. I will have more unboxing videos for you and hopefully more cleaning videos. I'm trying to get some more locomotives running again. So I hope you all enjoy this video. Remember, every view helps my channel. Go ahead and don't forget to ring that bell. This way you get further notification. And also, go ahead and subscribe. It's free. And always, God bless and you all have a wonderful day. Thank you.